The New York State Attorney has called the recent gun buyback program a landmark event as over 3,000 guns were surrendered in a single day across the state. The program was hosted and coordinated by the State Attorney General's office and it was held at nine buyback locations including two in New York City. The number of guns surrendered included numerous assault rifles and ghost guns. Participants were offered $500 gift cards for turning in these types of firearms with no questions asked. Those who surrendered handguns were also given $500 gift cards for the first weapon surrendered and $150 gift cards for each additional handgun. Rifles and shotguns were exchanged for $75 gift cards, while non-working replicas, antiques or 3D printed guns were exchanged for $25 gift cards. The gun buyback program was held just days after a Syracuse mayor, Ben Walsh, expressed his concern about the ongoing proliferation of guns in his community which he said is contributing to the rise in violent crime rates. The police crime statistics show a 133% jump in homicides in Syracuse in the first four months of this year compared to the same time last year. Community residents turned over 751 firearms in Syracuse alone, and officials said 90 guns were surrendered in the first three hours of the buyback program at the All Saints Catholic Church in Brooklyn, New York. The recent buyback program is part of an effort to combat gun violence in New York State. Attorney General James said in a statement that every gun that we removed out of Syracuse homes and off the streets is a potential tragedy averted and another step in protecting communities throughout the New York State. Brooklyn District Attorney Eric Gonzalez also spoke about the significance of the program, saying that each and every one of these guns is potentially a life save and a non-fatal shooting avoided.